No screeching. Ugh. My head. Where am I? No pants? Oh, let me think. I was escorting a witch to Narciss. She got frisky, but I'm a married man. After that, my memories get hazy. I think she cast a spell on me and took a valuable axe. It's been in my wife's family for generations. My wife will kill me if I lost her axe. Oh, my head. Hey, you could find that screeching witch and get the axe back. I think we had a small camp nearby. I'll catch up to you after my head stops hurting. If I come back without that axe, Evigna will never forgive me. And her mother, she'll give me that look. The one that says her daughter married a fool. Well, Norgrid Hardhelm is no fool. A witch cast a spell. That's the only explanation for why that axe left my hands. want? Of course not. Let me guess. You met my drunken fool of a husband, Norgred. I'm sure he was remorseful, hungover, and making up stories. He lost the axe of Halmer Stormhand and tried to blame a witch? What he did was drink too much last night. He was bellowing about witches and plague husks when I came back with my herbs. Then he ran off half-dressed, waving the axe and yelling incoherently. I'd be grateful if you found it, too. Norgred probably dropped it near that house by the water where the plague husks have gathered. It's not that far. Just down the hill. Maybe you'll find his pants there while you're at it. Oh, I am so doomed. My wife? What about the witch? Oh, gods. I need to get that axe back. I think I remember fighting those husks. But thanks for finding the axe of Halmer Stormhand. 
I don't like it when Edvigna gets upset. She gets... very loud. These don't look like my pants, but thank you for finding the axe. I wish I could find that witch and teach her not to tangle with Norgrid Hardhelm. There's my brave, pantsless warrior. Do you remember anything from last night? There you are, my sweet. Uh, Briar Hart. I battled a witch last night. Was she frightened off by your nakedness? Put some pants on, you sot. goes into the gorge. Got that? Do we say why the pass is closed? Tell them there's death in the pass. Leave it at that. Yes, yes Commander. Commander. The gorge is closed. If you're going to Mournhold, find a different way. Speak to Captain Deril if you need something. About damn time we got some help out here. We're outmatched. Captain Deeril will give you a little more insight into what's happening here. If you're planning to use the pass to Mournhold, find another route. It's not safe. The Morborn have overrun the trader's camp and occupied the pass. By the authority of House Hlalu, this area is closed. It's a death trap. We sent in some scouts to assess the situation, but they haven't returned. I don't want to march in there blindly, but we can't wait much longer. This pass is too important to allow it to fall into the Mulborn's hands. It's the primary trading route between Mornhold and the West. It's also home to a trader's camp. Every caravan that comes through this part of Dushan depends on that camp. That's an excellent question. Harassing caravan seems to go against their usual method of operations, doesn't it? Port. Back. Morborn. They're trying to make the plague stronger. The alchemist who created the Lotus Plague. Murdendril. He's making it stronger. More potent. The Morborn plan to smuggle it into Mornhold. Infect the whole city. There's no time. You need to stop them. The Morborn can't bring cargo through the city gates without official papers. They're carrying forged shipping manifests. Maybe it's worth a try. Take out some of the Morburn down in the trader's camp. Get those forged papers. Kothal's the name. I was working as a guard in the trading camp before the Morborn attacked. This elven scout was lucky I came along when I did. 
she was getting her arse handed to her. Did what I was taught to do. When outnumbered, I hide. Not the bravest move, but it kept the two of us alive. Listen, if you're going down there, I could use your help. I need some things from the camp. Things that are too important to fall into the hands of the Marlborn. They're in three locked chests, so you'll need to get the keys first. Three of the merchants I worked for wore the keys on chains around their necks. They were the first to fall when the Marlborn attacked. But I don't think their bodies were searched very thoroughly. I'm afraid I'm not at liberty to say. All I can tell you is I swore to guard those chests with my life. That ought to give you some idea of their importance.
did you get the stuff from the locked chests? Um, yeah. Fact is, I kind of lied to you. Those merchants owed me weeks of back pay, and now they're dead. My family will starve without that money. Those trinkets you recovered may not seem like much, but they'll feed my family for a year. I could not risk it. I'm sorry I misled you, but I can't let my children go hungry. I don't know what to say. Thank you. I'll find a way to make up for this. I swear it. On my life, I'll make sure this Lalu elf gets out of here safely. The manifests. Did you get them? Good. This should buy us enough time to act. Good question. Before we strike back, we need to gather our swords. I wish I knew how many of the others survived. I think most of them were captured. I saw some of them dragged off toward that cave to the north. I'll report to Deryl and let him know what's happening here. You go to the cave and see if you can find the others. Those Nyx hounds won't take me. Won't make me into a husk. Bled myself with my own blade. No use to them now. That'll show them. I... What was I saying? Did Scout Marmin send you? I was glad she got away. The others, they're all gone. I've seen what the plague does to a body. I won't let it take me. But if the wards were destroyed... Arcane wardstones that make the Moorborn immune to the plague. A gift from someone called Vox. Sure would be a shame if those Aelids came down with their own plague. How about you smash those wards that are protecting them? I heard them crying out in the darkness. The plague's taken them. They've... turned. The wards. Concentrate on the wards. There are three of them. Smash them all. Those wards keep the Moorborn from getting infected by their plague. Smash them, and may the plague take them all. Down into the cave, the same place they dragged the others. May the three watch over their souls now.
Good, you're still alive. Scout Marmine told us she sent you to this cave. Veron says he knows you from Narsis. He and his ally have offered their assistance. We have to proceed cautiously. I don't want any more of my soldiers getting infected. But the Moleborn have to be dealt with. For good. Ah! That changes things! We've spotted the plague ship and they planned for Mournhold. I want those crates destroyed, but I need my troops at a safe distance when it happens. Always. A cliff overlooks their loaded wagons, and I've got archers up there. Get to Nariu Virian. Tell her to have the archers shatter the crates from above. We'll see how the Moleborn like being exposed to their own plague. Good idea. Exactly what we need. On your way, then. That tunnel will take you to the top of the cliff. There's war, and then there's just slaughter. The Moleborn fight without honor. I don't expect we'll be taking any prisoners. I told you we'd be right behind you. I'm truly beginning to understand what Nariu sees in you. You certainly know how to get things done. Oh, she's out and about. Like you, she's out doing what she does best. Now, talk to the captain and let's get on with things. Ready for a fight? Once the archers start shooting, the Marlborn will swarm this overlook. Let me know when you're ready. Archers, to your positions! Once the arrows start flying, they'll be on us in no time. Here they come! All. Prepare to die. Spread up. We did it. All right. Back to the cave. Change of plans. Those crates the archers destroyed. Plague is spreading quicker than Dragon's Breath. Can't go that way. Hey, I'm not an alchemist. I can only tell you what Veron told me. That stuff is potent. It spreads like wildfire. As soon as it touches skin, people transform into husks. Talk to Veron about the next steps. All my brilliant ideas at the moment just involve avoiding the plague. I warned that fool Deeril not to go on ahead. If he's not a husk yet, he's probably a feast for one. That plague moves like lightning. 
He took some troops to the southern side of the gorge. He's looking for the Maulborn leader, the alchemist. I don't know if he made it that far or not. Don't need to tell us twice. We'll stay on high ground until the plague dissipates. If you find Deril and he's turned, do what you have to, understand? By Aeum! You've run through a gauntlet of plague and death, yet you aren't sick! How? We'll consider it a blessing of the Tribunal for now and leave it at that. The Maulborn who haven't fallen to the plague are in retreat. We've just one final matter to attend to. We've got Medindral, the alchemist who created the Lodos Plague, cornered in these ruins. We need to capture him and find out how he did it. With you at our side, we can't fail. That's the spirit. We're right behind you. Remember, we have to find out how the plague was made. Then we can get to work on making a cure. Let's go. On your guard. We don't know what's up ahead. Look everywhere. Any clues we find may lead us to the cure.
What did you find? What is that? That's the recipe for the Lodos Plague! We've done it! Wait. What's happening? You resist my plague? Let's try a stronger version. No! No, not that! You didn't think it would be that easy, did you? I shall experiment upon your body. Our champion survives. What happened in there? Where's Dewell? He's gone, isn't he? He died valiantly, then. Did you learn anything in there that would help us? Praise Vivek. With the notes, we can finally craft a cure. The Molborn have fallen to their own plague. The merchants are already returning to their camp. The stuff in the crates was extremely potent, but also very short-lived. It came and went fast, and we haven't seen any more afflictions. But if this had reached Mournhold... Still, we can't lower our defenses yet. This was just one piece of the Molburn scheme. But for now, the Gorge and Mournhold are safe. The pass is open again. House Laru will keep it that way. But watch yourself. I fear Vox isn't finished yet. You're full of surprises. Not that I doubted you. Thanks for your help. You know, I think you earned the truth. But this is a pretty big secret I'm about to share. Are you sure you're up to the responsibility? I know you won't. Come closer. This is for your ears only. Veron and I were part of the Morag Tong. You're kind of an innocent, aren't you? The Morag Tong? Organized crime? A league of assassins? We used to be part of the establishment, but we're kind of on the out these days. Some of the house leaders still employ us, though. Keep your voice down. Just being associated with the Morag Tong can get me put to death. We're here on behalf of Mournhold, understand? Now get out of here. You're full of surprises. Not that I... With the death of the alchemist Merdindril, our contract is fulfilled. I'm not sure we could have accomplished it without you. On to our next assignment. We don't get a lot of downtime. We're always on the job, always watching. Are you heading to Mournhold now? Someone has to tell Ordinator Kilau what happened here. You appear to be available for the job. I'm sure we'll run into each other again. Hopefully it won't be because your name's on a contract.
The afflicted found their way up here while you were inside. But we cut them down. Every one of them. I'd like to catch up with the Moorborn and give them what they gave the merchants. How many lives does this box have to take? Deeril, the merchants? She needs to pay for what she's done. <clears throat> no traces of plague must survive. The bodies have to burn. They came out of nowhere, attacked the caravan. I'm fine. I just hope my brother's all right. We've got the raiders on the run. Didn't hurt that their machines turned against them. Raiders attacked our caravan. They had Dwarven machines with them, like spiders. They ambushed us. We should have been slaughtered, but then the attack broke off. Something went wrong. The spiders suddenly attacked everybody and everything. We captured one of the raiders in the chaos. She's wearing the insignia of House Drez. One of her Dunmer great houses. There's rivalry between the houses, but not open conflict. You're an outsider. Maybe the prisoner will talk to you. We're holding her up the road in the ruined tower. The prisoner's in the tower. Up the path and enter the tower on your left. 